Hello. Hi. I'm Katerino, and today I'm going to be cooking some gyoza. <laughs> Miss Kate, what's gyoza, you may ask? Well, chat, I'm glad you asked. Gyoza is a Japanese dumpling. We are taking this recipe from this Iron Chef named Morimoto. He's fucking cool. He makes funky ass sushi. And he's funky and he's cool and he's Japanese and he makes gyoza too. And I got a cookbook for Christmas. So guess what we're doing now? Making gyoza. We're making gyoza. We're making we're making gyoza now. We're making gyoza. Listen, okay? I went to the store today to purchase some ground pork, which I almost couldn't find. I was very stressed out. I was like, what the fuck am I gonna do? They have ground turkey, they have ground chicken, they have ground beef, but no ground pork. You gotta freaking freaking me, dude. And then I found this, but you know what? The recipe calls for, and I quote, <clears throat> One half pound fatty ground pork such as shoulder or belly. This is the only ground pork Publix had. And it specifically says 90% lean, 10% fat. So I'm fucked is what I'm trying to tell you. Here's our pork and cabbage dumplings. They call for, for the filling, four cups finely chopped Napa cabbage. Napa, Napa. One and a half cups thinly sliced garlic chives, which I don't know what those are. And it says you can replace it with one and a half cup thinly sliced scallions plus one teaspoon minced garlic. So we have that, we have that. Uh, one tablespoon plus half teaspoon kosher salt. We have regular sea salt because I don't fucking fuck me. Half pound fatty ground pork. It's pretty lean ground pork, but like it is what it is. It's ground pork. It's the only ground pork they had at the pet level. So. One tablespoon Japanese sake. One half tablespoon toasted sesame oil. Now this is just regular sesame oil. Do I have to toast it? I don't know. Brown white pepper to taste. No, I don't know the difference between white and black pepper, but we got white pepper. Here we are. For the dumplings, 24 gyoza wrappers. We have, it doesn't say, but they look like a fuck ton of them. Two tablespoons vegetable oil. Actually, I don't know if they have vegetable oil. Am I fucked? We do have vegetable oil. Hoggers. This is my roommate's. I will buy them new vegetable oil. Japanese hot mustard to taste. Rice vinegar and scallions. Hype for my boy Zenny. Yeah! Hype, am I right? Okay, here we go. I'm gonna cook some Napa cabbage. Now, I don't know what makes this cabbage so sleepy. Sorry. <laughs> We're gonna cook. We're gonna cook, okay? Okay, I don't know how to do this. It's just so thinly sliced. But into what? Like, th thinly sliced is so vague. Four cups, finely chopped, finely chopped, not thinly sliced, finely chopped. <gasps> Combine the cabbage and garlic chives or scallions and garlic cube using in a medium mixing bowl. <laughs> Is, this... Is this finely chopped? Look at this. Is this what they want? No. Wash the food. Oh, fuck. I have to wash the cabbage! Ah! Oh my god! There's water everywhere! How are you? Hi. I've been loving the streams recently and just wanted to say thank you for always making me laugh even when I'm having a bad day. Less than three. That was really romantic. Thank you so much for the two dollars. That was so sweet. I could just bundle you up and chop you up like Napa cabbage. No, like... In a, <laughs> in a cute way, though. <laughs> <laughs> okay, here we go. Ooh, speed run, speed run, speed run, speed run, speed run. Ah! Ah! Does it look good? Is that good? Please, please don't. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> okay, it calls for one teaspoon of garlic. I feel like this will be too much, right? So should I just do two cloves? I think even two cloves will be too much, but I'm just gonna do it. Ready? Smash! Murder the garlic. Your chopping skills make me believe I'm about to watch an episode of Kate Goes to the Hospital. You yeah, listen, right? That's fine. If we have to stream from the hospital, then we have to stream from the hospital, okay? I'm not worried. 
Do you peel any part of the, the scallion? Do you peel it or do you just go for it? Because there's like film peeling off. Just cut the bottom off and then start going. Okay. Whoa! There's like cum in, inside of this. What? Bro, what? Honey, it's the xylem and phone. Fuck you. <laughs> Honey, don't you obviously know? Someone just honeyed me in chat. What the fuck? <laughs> Honey, it's so obvious. Honey, it's the xylem and folium in the fucking green onion. Are you so fucking stupid? Fucking, uh, honey, duh. <laughs> the xylem and folia. <laughs> there really do be gummies coming out of here. Okay, that's probably enough. Isn't that a nice sound? Listen. It's kind of ASMR-y. I watch an ASMR cooking channel all the time. This is soothing. Wait, let me just not talk for a little bit. Let's just listen to the sounds of the kitchen. Holy shit! That was actually cool. Victory dance. So now all we have to do is we have to combine the cabbage mixture, pork, sake, sesame oil, white pepper, and the remaining half teaspoon of salt in a medium mixing bowl. You look like working at an ice cream shop? Well, I work at a fucking gyoza shop. Bitch, we are dumpling makers. Ooh, ooh. We're making dumplings. We are the dumpling gods. We are the samurai of dumplings. Gyoza warriors. I am a gyoza warrior. How's that look, chat? Does that look good? My meat mixture? Ooh, here is a gyoza paper. No, it doesn't look that bad. Honestly. Oh, wait! Wait, that actually fucking looks like gyoza. Oh! Holy shit! Oh, bitch! That looks good as fuck. Doesn't it look so nice? Holy shit. It actually looks like a little gyoza guy. Oh, it's even better than the first one. Fucking flawless. What the heck? Look at this little thing. Chat, I thought this would be a disaster. We're just gonna make however many we can. My friends are really excited because they really like gyoza, so I'm really excited that this is actually turning out well so that they can eat my gyoza and be like, holy shit, this is good. And I'm like, yeah, I fucking know it, bitch. It's a good, nice dumpling. You don't find good, nice dumplings everywhere. There might be prettier dumplings, but this one, this one will care for you. This one will provide for you. All right, here's the sauce. Let's try it. That's so vinegary. So we're gonna, Add some more soy sauce. Oh, that's a lot of soy sauce. What the fuck? Okay, come on. We're gonna add more soy sauce, and then we're gonna add more hot mustard, because I could not taste it at all. Is this one, this one is still alive. The brown is being, the bottom is being brown. We're doing fine. How's this one? Ooh. Mm -hmm. Ow. Okay. Okay, wait a second. Chad, look at this little sexy bugger. Ooh, ooh, look at this one. Mmm, that's a nice, um, spicy, spicy dumpling. That one's pretty good. They look pretty good though, damn. It smells good. Ready, here we go. Ooh. Oh no. Mmm! Oh, this is good. Oh my god, this is good. Oh. And our sauce that we made. Ready? Cheers. Actually, good. Holy shit. That's good as fuck. You guys want to try it? I'll give them good ones. Yeah. Do you hate it? No, it's very good. 
Do you like it? It's nice and crispy. Yay! That's pretty good. That's good fun. Mm -hmm.